hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Megan with her courage to plan today we've got to go ahead and do our mid-month check-in for November guys if this is your first time watching one of my videos I'll go ahead and link a playlist up above so that you can go back and watch some of our other budgeting videos so you can get an understanding of how my husband and I handle our finances. Also, I'll go ahead and link the videos of how and why we started our debt-free journey. But this is just our mid-month check-in through the 15th of November. I'm going to use my green paper mate ink joy pen now if you want to get your hands on it i do have my amazon links down below as a reminder this here budget kit this november kit is still in my etsy shop and it is available now my november budget kit you will get two sizes you'll get your 7 by 9.25 which fits your classic size happy planner or similar planners of that size and you'll also get your eight and a half by 11, your regular US letter size. That'll automatically come in your budget kit. And you also get budget stickers. You get your bill due stickers, you get your payday stickers, you get your monthly scripts, guys. I also have the December kit out and I have some other kits as well that are neutral color. You wanna go ahead and check out my Etsy shop and maybe you'll see something that you do like. And I also have budget sets where you'll get your paycheck budget and you'll get your monthly budget if you just wanted to try it out, okay? But the link is down below to my Etsy shop in the description box. All right, guys, so for Hub's income, he did receive thus far 1702 and then thus far i've received 640. now since this is the actual monthly budget this rollover from october is indicated in here but i've accounted for it in our paycheck number two budget so since it's accounted for in the paycheck number two i'm just putting a dash there so that it's not being accounted for at mid-month check but when we come back and do our actual for our overall monthly then of course I will account for it then if that makes sense. For our mid-month check, which is our MM check, the income is $23.42. And then for tithe and offering mid-month check, we're at $6.95. And then for our mortgage that was paid, $502. Netflix, $15.99. Our internet, $149.78. And YouTube, $11.99. And so for electricity, that has not been paid yet car insurance hasn't been paid Hulu hasn't been paid HELOC these haven't been paid yet all right and then for groceries now we've already spent $345.56 of our $700 grocery budget and then for lawn service, like I said, we're being billed monthly, so that hasn't been paid yet. And then for our house supplies, I've spent $30.77 thus far. And then for gas, I've spent $30.57 thus far. And our car registration, that has been paid. And then our buffer. Now, I explained in the last video, our paycheck number one check-in, that my son woke up, he wasn't feeling too hot, and so we had to make sure that he was taken care of. And I had to get a few items from Walmart. Um, and of course, $25 per copay. So a total of $82.03 was spent of the buffer thus far for our mid-month check. $25 savings, that automatically is drafted from our joint household checking account and put into our joint household savings account. And that's automatically done on the 30th of every month. So of course, that hasn't been paid yet. But the tuition and the vacation has been taken care of. So a total of $250 has been taken care of for savings. So for the HELOC extra debt, now at mid-month, $25.24 has been set aside. And like I always say, I like to make sure I wait to the end to balance out to see how much extra we can put on that HELOC. All right, and so I'm gonna go ahead and total our mid-month check expenses. 502-1599. 149.78, 11.99, 345.56, 30.77, 
57, 154, and 8203. So a total of $13,2269 has been spent as of our mid-month check, which is basically our paycheck number one check-in. All right, and so down here on my budget worksheet, I have a mid-month check-in, MM check section. So everything in the total MM check column, I will plug down here. And guys, I'm telling you, I'm just loving this worksheet. Oh my God. It has made everything so much easier. All right, so for income, total is 23.42 and then giving 6.95 so I just bring that down and then our total expenses here is 13.2269 and then savings 250 and then the extra debt we put $25.24 aside so here we'll go ahead and run these numbers so 23.42 Minus 695, minus 132269, minus 250, minus 2524. That leaves us with $49 and 7 So we are looking pretty good. We're not over budget. So I'm very happy and excited about that. Leave me a comment down below. How is your November monthly budget going? I know we got Thanksgiving holiday coming up. I know we got Black Friday guys, and I hope that you have budgeted for it or at least have a plan. So I'm not gonna be out here in these streets I'm going to order a few things online that I want. I actually started early. Um, a few weeks ago, I purchased something um, offline. So I'm just kind of waiting till I get all my stuff and I can do a big haul. All right, guys. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button for me. If you have not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. What you waiting on? Come on, come on, come on. And if you're not following me on Pinterest and Instagram, head on over there and follow me on Instagram and Pinterest, guys. All right. So I appreciate each and every one of you. And until the next time, I will see you later. Bye. <music>